Hey, what's up, Tech Ninjas? It's your IT Samurai teacher back again with another Raspberry Pi tutorial. Today, we are keeping it simple by showing you how to list all the users on your Raspberry Pi file and what each username does. This will help you better understand the system accounts and servers running on your Raspberry Pi file. So, let's jump right in. The easiest way to see all the users on your Raspberry Pi files by using the following command. Type cut dash D F1 etc PASSWT. This command will display all the username that are stored in the etc dash uh, pass wd file these represent both system accounts and user accounts let's take a look at the output you can see we got a, a nice detail list um, now let's go over what each of these username does most of them are system accounts but it's good to know what they represent here's a quick breakdown the first one is root. This is the super user account which has full control over the system. You should only use this account when absolutely necessary. Next one, Damien. This account runs background services or Damien's. You won't log into this account directly, but it's essential for keeping services running. Bin. Used for managing system binaries and executables. SYS. This account is responsible for system related tasks like administrative process. Sync. It's used for synchronizing files and file system in a safe manner. Games, a legacy account, typically not used anymore, but it's there as a uh, but it's there for any game related process. MAN man. Hence the manual pages you access through the man command. LP used by the system's printing services to manage printers. X mail responsible for managing the local mail system on your Raspberry Pi 5. News an old account used for managing news servers, not commonly used now. UUCP manage file transfers using an older protocol called UUCP. You probably won't interact with this. Proxy handles web proxy services such as HTTP proxies. WW-data. This account used for web servers like Apache to run services uh, securely without exposing sensitive parts of your system. Backup manages system backups ensuring files can be saved with the right permission list used for email list management typically with mailing list software irc used by the irc internet relay chat system if you have installed you can see underscore uh, dash apt this use uh, uh, handles package downloads and installation via APT package manager. Next, we have nobody. A special account that represents a non privileged user. Services that don't require special permissions to run as nobody. System D uh, network handles time synchroniz uh, synchronization services for your system. Uh, can see uh, my bad so system MD network this account is responsible for managing network settings and services on your Raspberry Pi and system MD time sync has time synchronization service for your system and message bus runs the D services uh, runs the D bus services which allow different application to communicate with each other RPC this account manages remote procedures called RPC services, allowing programs on a different machine to communicate. SSHD, this user is used by the SSH server, which allows you to log in remotely to your Raspberry Pi file. 
STATD uh, part of the NF, uh, NFS system used for managing file locking ac ac across a network. AVAHI, this account runs a VAHI, a service that helps devices discover each other on a, uh, on a lo local network. POLK, P O L K I T D. Uh, so P O L K I T is responsible. Polkit is responsible for managing system privileges and ensuring process can access the resources they need. DNS M A S Q used by services that requires DNS and D H C P like setting up network. L I H T T D M. Uh, like DM is the display manager responsible for graphical logging screen. RTKIT, this account helps manage real time tasks such as audio processing to ensure smooth performance. Pulse runs the Pulse audio service which manages sounds on your Raspberry Pi 5. SANED manage scanning devices over the network. VNC used by the VNC services for remote desktop access to your Raspberry Pi. Color D handles color profile management for your devices, run ensuring accurate color representation. HPLIP runs HP's printed drivers and device, uh, services on your Raspberry Pi 5. Pi 5, uh, finally, this is the user account that was created for this Raspberry Pi 5. You'll be using this account the most when you interact with your Raspberry Pi 5. You can see Raspberry Pi 5 in here. So we can identify this is the default user account. So there you have it. Now you know how to list all the users on your Raspberry Pi 5 and what each of them does. Most of these accounts are system users that keep everything running smoothly, but it is good to know who's who, right? If this video was helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more tips on Raspberry Pi tech tutorials. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or suggestions for future videos. This is your IT Samurai teacher signing off. Catch you in the next one.